FCC and the ex-governor of Anambra State. You know, I'm just wondering how many misfortune can befall someone in one day after his wife was slapped in public and he was arrested in same day by EFCC? Hello, trending gist lovers. Welcome back to my channel. I remain your girl, Octavia Cora. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on your notification bell. Just support your girl. Let's keep going. Keep tapping that red subscribe button. Anyways, let's talk some politics today. Okay. Obiano has been arrested by EFCC. A lot of people are talking about it, but right now the Anambra women are upset, okay? But we will get to that later, okay? So this is what EFCC had to say. They said, um, Obiano's arrest is not political because a lot of people are saying this might be political, you know, because election is around the corner. Anyways, feel free to comment down below. Here they say he has been granted bail, but yet to fulfill his bail condition. EFCC boss... Abdul Rashid Bawa speaks. The chairman of the Economic and Financial Crime Commission, EFCC, has denied the claims that the recent arrest and questioning of the immediate past governor of Anambra State, Willie Obiano, is political. Speaking to newsmen at the 5th Annual General Assembly of the Network of National Anti-Corruption Institution in West Africa, what Nasiwa? Okay, today, March 21st, Bawa said the former governor who was arrested on March 17th while attempting to travel to the U.S. has been granted an administrative bail board. Hmm, there's a but, okay? <laughs> but that the former governor is yet to meet his bail condition, and I wonder what those conditions are. Okay, let's continue. Nothing political about this arrest of the former Anambra State Governor, Willie Obi Anno. He has been granted bail, but he awaits when he fulfills his bail conditions. Uh, comment down below, what do you think these bail conditions might be? Okay, so right now, let's move on to the next, where the Anambra women are upset. Let's go. I guess the women are really ready to do this, so mm, watch out, EFCC. Women in Anambra State, under the edges of Anambra not Women Empowerment Movement, have threatened to protest naked at the headquarters of the Economic and Financial Crime Commission, EFCC, if the... Um, if the immediate past governor of the state, Willie Obiano, is not released. Recall that uh, Obiano was arrested on March 17th while on his way to the U.S. hours after, his, um, after he uh, handed over to the new governor of the state, Charles Soludo. In a statement released on Monday, March 21st, the chairman of AWEM, Uju Ifunaya Edoche, frowned at the release um at the release of a video showing the governor in efcc's custody she maintained that the efcc facility is not safe considering how a video of an ex-governor could be made where it is uh, supposed to be a protective custody and sent to social media for the public to mock the, the former governor the group then threatened to uh, protest at efcc abuja office if they don't release him comment down below and let me know what you think health, yeah. you gotta work never tell keep your head down find what you love and excel 